Beautiful. How you doing? It's Michael Jackson, Michael Jackson Physiotherapy, here at Physique. Today I just want to show a quick video. This is really, I have a pet peeve about therapists and other body workers that mobilize the uh, clenohumeral joint, the shoulder joint, um, especially when there's a, a, a deficit in internal rotation, okay? Um, basically, if you don't know what's going on with the rest of the body, meaning where the arm is attached to, the rib cage and everything else, um, which they all have an effect on the shoulder joint and the, uh, the scapula, the whole shoulder complex. So it could be not just the shoulder that has the problem that needs more mobilization or stretching, it could just be you need to work on the positioning of the other parts of the body. So for example, this is Paula, she's one of the trainers here. I've, I've never assessed her or evaluated her, so we're, we're going cold because that's how we roll at physique. Um, so what I want to do is I'm just going to check her shoulder range of motion. Just going to bring the arm over to the side. Like this. Okay. And that's her, that's her internal rotation over there. Okay, I just want to see her external rotation. She's good there. So again, she's not too bad, but she's not all the way. All right. So really quick, I'm going to check her left side. Okay. Left side, definitely more motion here. Okay. Now, watch this. Bring your legs up for me. Hold the other hand. Yeah. Now let's see what happens. Edge it again. Okay. It comes a little bit more, as you can see. I'm not making this up. I'm not cranking it or whatever. Okay, now watch this. Now just hold this up for me. Bring this arm over here. Just hold the legs up for me. Okay, let's see. Now watch this. And relax the arm. Yeah. So, when I bring it all the way up, actually goes even more. Now, bring this down a sec. Now keep this over here like this. Bring your legs to the side like there. So let's see here. So that doesn't do anything. Now I'm gonna bring her legs to rotate the pelvis and the spine the other way. Okay. And bingo, okay? That's full range of motion pretty much. Just shy, but it's a lot more than was before when her legs were extended. Bring her legs down. where the resistance is, okay? So, I mean, I could probably crank it, but I'm really just going to where the resistance starts. So, she wasn't as dramatic, but there was a difference when I put her legs in a certain position, which repositioned her pelvis, which repositioned her spine and her rib cage, and it affected her shoulder. So, if you came in and she had more of a deficit, let's say it was only 45 degrees over there, and then when you flexed her legs or rotated her pelvis and her spine, and she went down to 60 degrees, um, if you didn't do that, and you just saw the 45 degrees, and you just started doing mobilizations, you're creating a, um, an instability. So stop it. All right. So that's all I wanted to say. I want to get that off my chest. Made it official by making another video. All right. Until the next time. See you later.